Jonathan, talk about DC United. Last time you guys had played them, of course, victorious, but they seem to be patting themselves as the top in the East. How do you feel that you guys measure up next to them? I think we feel confident against them. Um, you know, obviously they're, they've had a good run this first uh, half of the season and they just got a good result, uh, a big result in Chicago. Um, so we know that this game will be difficult. Um, but at the same time, we know we, we went over there and beat them on their field and we have a confidence that we can beat them again, especially uh, with a more advantage coming back home. Probably the biggest difference from the last time you played them to this time, Bill Hamid will most likely be in net. How different of a team is it when he is in net? It's probably a lot different. Um, you know, Bill helps them a lot. He makes a lot of key saves and a lot of saves that other normal goalkeepers couldn't make. So um, he, he, keeps that, he keeps that team moving uh, quick too. Uh, when he gets the ball, it's, it's, it's released quick out of his hands. So uh, we'll definitely be playing against a, a, a totally different team on Saturday. Uh, this game against Montreal this past Wednesday showed that this team has some depth in the midfield, particularly with the youngster Marquis Delgado. How do you feel that he handled himself? He was, uh, he was excellent. Um, mm -hmm. He did really well. Um, I thought Colin also did really well sliding into that defensive mid role. And uh, we were, I thought we were solid throughout the whole game. Uh, it, it, it was a good team performance, not only by the midfield, but from the goalkeeper up to the forwards. Uh, it, was a, it was a really good total team performance. For yourself personally, how important is it for you to end on a positive result as you head out to Gold Cup duties? It's very important to me. Um, you know, I, I wish we could have won all these games uh, this month before I went. Uh, unfortunately, we didn't win against New York City, but uh, we bounced back really well against Montreal. And, and this is a big game on Saturday. Uh, we're playing against the, the team that's at the top of the table right now in the Eastern Conference. And if we can steal another three points from them, that will just put us in, in great position for the rest of the season. You seem to be, and maybe I'm wrong, but you seem to be playing with a great deal more confidence this year. You're much more decisive on the ball and sort of be taking a lot more responsibility. Not that you weren't doing that last year, but it just seemed like it's more pronounced in your game this year. Why is that, do you think? I think it's just experience. Um, playing more and more, the more games I play, the, the more comfortable I am, the more I learn. And uh, the quicker I am to make decisions, because uh, decisions become now re repetitive, so it, it becomes easier and easier. Uh, I think this year, uh, beginning was just tough. I, th I, I honestly didn't think I was playing bad or anything. I just thought I, I, I wasn't out of my comfort zone. And now, um, the team around me has done a good job of giving me confidence to, to, to express myself and, and be free and, and play the way I've always played my whole life. And that's just to be free and, and be creative um, in, in certain spots that I, I get to on the field. Any mixed emotions about, obviously you want to represent your country and, and we get that, but because you're in such a you know nice run of form with Toronto, any sort of mixed emotions about having to leave now? Yeah, I mean it's it's always tough leaving this club, um, especially uh, at this time when we're on a, such a good run and everything. But at the same time, I love representing my country, and and this is really big. This is a big time for our country. I think it's it's really huge. Um, I think these results are really important because it. it it might decide the, the future of, of, fo of football in, in this country. Um, you know, and, and, and if we do good, we, we have a lot, we turn a lot of heads and, and then maybe the younger players start to believe in themselves when they go to tournaments and everything. So it, it, it's huge and, and I'm, I'm really looking forward to this challenge coming up.